Hello, I'm Matteo, the Chief Mobile Opinionist at the Tech Travel Geeks, and this is a sample video shot on the Honor 20e. If you don't already, please do subscribe to the Tech Travel Geeks here on YouTube. Right then, it's a Friday evening, uh, I'm in Edinburgh and decided to walk up Kerstorfin Hill. I'm in the local nature reserve. Uh, having a look west at the thunder and lightning rolling in from Glasgow's direction. But the purpose of this video is to see how the Honor 20e handles uh, 1080p, so full high definition video, at 60 frames per second. And as you can see, the lighting conditions aren't perfect, it's not a bright uh, moment, you can see the clouds rolling in there with thunder, but there's plenty of light and overall I'd say this is decent footage. I've run a few tests in different conditions with the Honor 20e and it's performed quite well as long as lighting conditions are nice to it. This is a bit more challenging, there's a bit of, uh, let's put it this way, lightness as well as darkness in, in the woods here in Kerstorfin Hill. So it's a bit of a challenge for the sensor. And that's the 24 megapixel uh, camera module that we're using here. It's the main sensor. Uh, I could also use the wide angle sensor, but that's uh, not something I think is worthwhile publishing a dedicated video for. Now let's have a look at how it handles autofocus. Got some flowers here, moving in the wind. Oh, here we go, we've got some nice creepy crawlies. So focus, tap to focus, and I was tapping there on the red creepy crawly. There we go. Say hello. So that's not too bad. It taps to focus, and if I want to focus on the flowers, it will do that. So I, I have to say, the autofocus, or the tap to focus is pretty good, especially considering this phone is currently available on Amazon as well as at the Carphone Warehouse in the UK for under £150. So that's really quite a good deal. Carphone Warehouse also has some deals where you can get the Honor 20e with a pay-as-you-go SIM card. Technically the phone is cheaper but then you need to buy a top-up, but that might be exactly what you need. Now, the context switch between the flowers and focusing on the flowers and then raising the phone up, it doesn't immediately focus. It take, the autofocus takes a while. Whereas if I tap on the bushes in the background, it takes its time to adjust focus there which is not great, but then again, what is the chances of you actually needing that sort of feature? As I said, for a £150 smartphone, you're getting a lot of smartphone, and that camera can take some decent, decent full high definition video, provided you have good lighting conditions. But in low light, it will struggle a little. Anyway, uh, this, I'll wrap up this video uh, of the Honor 20 sample in 1080 at 60 frames per second. If you don't already, please do subscribe to the Tech Travel Geeks here on YouTube. And for now, thanks for watching and keep stay tuned to the Tech Travel Geeks. We should have our full review of the Honor 20 as well as the full review of the Honor 9X Lite live soon on the Tech Travel Geeks YouTube channel. Thanks for watching. Goodbye.